Can I build another me? So, that's all there is to say about me, I said to the robot. I'm quite ordinary, really. There are plenty of other kids just like me. But what do other people think of you? Asked the robot. That was a tricky question. Other ideas of me. What do other people think about me? Everyone I know sees me in a slightly different way. I think I'm funny, popular and good looking. Mimi. I play with him because he brings me food. My doctor. He gets a lot of calls and doesn't like jabs. My classmate. He's loud and tells silly jokes all the time. My mum. He's my oldest son and he doesn't always do what I say. Billy. He's my brother and sometimes he won't let me play with his toys. My teacher. He doesn't like maths and sometimes he messes around in class. My grandma. He's my grandson and he's a lovely boy. My friend. We go swimming together and he's good at breaststroke. An alien. He's an earthling and not as strong as me. I have lots of places to go, but every place has different people in it so sometimes I have to change to fit in. That's me at home, at grandma's house, on my own, at school, at swimming class, and with my friends. And these are the things that only I know. I don't always say everything out loud, so sometimes nobody knows what I'm really thinking. They can never get inside my head, no matter how hard they try. She looks like a hippo. I can put a funnier face than that. My back feels itchy. She's so pretty. This means that there is a whole world inside my head that nobody else can ever get into. And I think that that's amazing. I have no one but me. Grandma once told me that everyone is like a tree. Trees come in all different shapes and sizes. You can't choose what kind of tree you are, but you can choose how to grow. And you can decorate yourself in any way that you like. It doesn't matter how big your tree is, it's whether you like your tree, and that's what counts. So, who am I? The harder I think about it, the more questions I come up with. Thinking about yourself isn't always easy, but it can be fun. So, can you pretend to be me or is it too difficult? Hmm, yes, I think I can pretend to be you. Really? Great. We arrived back at my house. I was delighted. At last, the robot understood what I wanted him to do.